alafu nani akaambia nani Hey guys welcome back to Fast Fast Gossips 254 it your boy Malo Okay so agriculture cabinet secretary Peter Munya found himself on the receiving end of the netizens attacks after it emerged that his promise of lowering the price of maize flour was just by 2 Kenyan shillings on Tuesday Peter Munya promised to suspend levies on imported maize which would in turn lower the price of unga but according to the United Grain Millers Association chairman Ken Nyaga the move is inconsequential since it will only translate to a drop of 2 Kenyan shillings speaking to the business daily Ken Nyaga said the move is so insignificant we need a serious government intervention on making the maize available to reduce significantly on the cost of flour he also urged the government to directly talk with other countries to scrap the export permit levy he said if we can have direct government talk to scrap export permit levy then the price of maize will come down and this will have impact in the cost of the final product this news didn't go down well with the majority of kenyans who took to their socials to show their frustrations one tweet tweeted after working tirelessly around the clock The CS for Agriculture Peter Munya has managed to decrease the price of maize flour by a whopping 2 Kenyan shillings. This comes after a period where the prices rose by an average of 80 Kenyan shillings for a 2 kg packet of unga. Makofi Komheshimiwa. Another netizen tweeted, "Only 2 Kenyan shillings? It's so shameful and devastating." Another Kenyan tweeted, "So Mr. Tubob aka CS Munya addressed the whole nation regarding lowering unga price and then went ahead to reduce it by Tubob. Thanks Munya, the Tubob will pay school fees for three children. Kenyans are so happy." So what are your thoughts on this? Do you think Kenyans are right to attack CS Peter Munya or are they just overreacting? Let us know in the comment section below. Give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already and we will talk soon. Bye.